Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron here, New Life Pentecostal Church, Albany, Georgia. This is a Bible I worked on as general editor on the Premier Study Bible printed by Thomas Nelson and put out by Insignia Books and the copyrights owned by Apostolic Book Publishers International. And so I've done a review of one of these that's out of the wrapper. I just kind of wanted to show you what it looked like in the box, in the wrapper, all of this because um, obviously the other one, you know, and so my my siblings, my two sisters, my brother bought me this for my birthday or Christmas present last year. So obviously it's just come in, let you see the different sides, what it looks like. Clamshell box, we made that decision just because we like clamshell boxes. They're a lot easier to manipulate. Believe it or not, clamshell boxes are a little less expensive on a wholesale level as well. And so I'm going to keep this one in the packaging. I'm going to keep this one in the wrapping, how it comes. So you see it comes with a little gold seal down at the bottom, Appsock Publishers International. And this looks like it is three, it's either 341 or 391 of a thousand. They had to send these up to Kingsport, Tennessee to have all this done. So you can see this is how it looks. It comes wrapped, comes with the gold seal. And uh, I plan on keeping it that way, Lord willing, just as a keepsake. You might say, well, didn't, uh, you know, because you were general editor, didn't you get like one free? I got some sample copies of the various editions free, which I've shown. And even like the first pages I've done over the years in the process of this. But, uh, but no. <laughs> No, other than the sample copies, no, I didn't get anything free. So I was very thankful for my siblings to buy this. So the Premier Study Bible, one of a thousand. Now I will tell you, um, there were some issues. And what happened is, is in shipping, the uh, uh, some of the boxes got crushed in shipping. Um from Nelson to Sacramento, from Kingsport, Tennessee to Sacramento. So what that's an, and then every Bible, every commercially printed Bible, even this is one of the thousand Moroccan leather raised spine edges, one of the finest Bibles Thomas Nelson's ever printed anywhere, uh, you're gonna have about a three to five percent mess up rate. Something, a page is going to be wrong. Something's going to be messed up in there. So you always, okay, so we ordered a thousand. They always give you a little more than a thousand to make up for those that are messed up. But because we had the boxes messed up, it's probably instead of one of a thousand, it's going to end up being one of 900 because we're having to use uh, some of the others to replace some of the ones that were damaged. And you might say, well, just have Nelson print some more. It doesn't work that way. Like, you can't just go get a hundred Bibles printed. Okay, and let me just say, you can. But the cost is prohibitive. I mean, it's unbelievable. So, like, when Nelson went to print these, you know, they're printing 10,000 a few thousand cowhide, a few thousand leather soft, and a thousand of these. You know, so to say, oh, just print us another hundred Bibles, it, it, you just can't, basically. So it's going to end up probably being somewhere one of 900 instead of one of a thousand. So I just thought I'd let people know that. So Matt Jones at Insignia Books did an amazing job. Nathaniel Wilson, the uh, general editor. I'm managing editor. I may have said I was general editor. I didn't mean that. I'm managing editor. I do several videos in a row here. <laughs> so I misspeak sometimes. Um, it, it couldn't have been better to work with. And uh, and then the dozens, 80-something people that uh, helped across North America with this. Just unbelievable. The scholarship. And we're, we're working on a, a part two to clean up any you know misprints and stuff in there and uh, that'll probably be that may be 
one to five years. It's very difficult to tell. But uh, the, the rate it's selling, it may be closer to the one and a half, two years because it is selling quite well. So God bless. I'll talk with you later. In Jesus' name.